lot of smoke. It sure is, yeah. South. There are some major wildfires going on up there. Mm -hmm. I mean, they are taking up a huge portion of the country, and it's all streaming south. So making for some beautiful sunrises and mm -hmm. sunsets in Color. the Ozarks. Yeah, grab some pictures tonight or this evening during the sunset. Uh, if you see the beautiful red-colored sunset, temperatures out there this afternoon are going to be hot. This is likely going to be the hottest day of the work week. So just bear through it one more day, and then we have some relief inside. I do want to start you out by showing you the visible satellite. Now, this is actually a picture that's taken from a satellite that's orbiting Earth up in space. It takes a picture of the atmosphere so we can actually see what's going on. Now we do have some cloud cover on visible satellite. You can see that it's the whiter color that you see here around Springfield. That's actually cloud cover. However, if you look closely, you see almost a light gray and it spreads all throughout the country. This is cloud cover that we see here, but see the light gray color that's extending through Iowa, back through portions of Missouri, almost all the way down to Arkansas. That's the smoke plume that I was telling you about, and that's going to continue to be around today. You will likely see a hazy sky, even though we don't have much cloud cover here in the Ozarks. Kind of an interesting sight to see, and as I said, it does sometimes enhance the colors in the sunset, so enjoy that later on this evening. Should be pretty pretty up in uh, Lake of the Ozarks. That's where our tower cam is now. It does look a little bit hazy there on the horizon. 80 degrees currently at the Springfield Airport, and we have a southwest wind at 9 miles an hour. Dew points are also a little bit higher today than they were yesterday, meaning that it feels a little bit more sticky out the door. Current temperatures in Springfield, we are at 80 degrees, 81 right now in West Plains, 83 the current temperature in Humansville. As we take a look at the heat index, though, it's enhanced, and that's making our temperature feel a little bit warmer than it actually is. 86 the heat index in Humansville, 83 in West Plains. That's going to get a bit worse as we head throughout the afternoon. Here's the hour by hour forecast for today. Notice temperatures will be topping out in the upper 80s and low 90s, depending on where you're at. Feeling closer to mid 90s when you factor in the heat index. So, perfect day to head out to the pool. Here is the backyard forecast today 88 degrees. It will be dry, it will be hot. So, enjoy the dry conditions today because rain showers and thunderstorms start to move in tonight. UV index is also high today. Just a reminder, if you are going to enjoy the pool day, today UV index is a 10 for the Ozark, so almost topping the scale. If you are going to head out, of course, remember all of the protective gear. Not a whole lot of cloud cover in the Ozarks today to protect us from those dangerous rays. Here's what's happening. Rain is going to be moving in. A cold front is heading south. It'll be in central Missouri later this evening. This is about 9 p.m. Notice not a whole lot of rain activity along the frontal boundary just yet. We have to wait until we get after midnight. What we call the low-level jet starts to kick in. That enhances our rain showers and thunderstorms and there should be a complex that breaks out in central Missouri close to the St. Louis area. All of that is going to be diving to the southeast. So our northeastern counties in the Ozarks, they're going to see the rain showers and thunderstorms tonight and we have scattered storms in the forecast Wednesday, again on Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, an active week setting up here. Here's future casts. Notice that we stay mostly sunny throughout the afternoon. Temperatures are going to be hot today. Here comes the cloud cover. This is at one o'clock in the morning. Many of you likely not seeing the rain or storms until very, very early on Wednesday morning, and you'll likely have the rain around for the morning commute. If you're traveling on I-44 up near Rollo or toward St. Louis, watch out for the very heavy rain showers. This is 7 o'clock in the morning. There will likely be some torrential downpours in this. The severe weather risk is very low, but I think there could be some gusty winds coming out of that as well. And then on Wednesday afternoon, we set the stage for scattered shower and thunderstorm activity. Another complex moving almost the, over the exact same location coming through on Wednesday. There will likely be some risk for some flooding in our eastern counties, so watch for that in the coming days. 88 in Springfield today, 90 in Harrison. Winds pretty breezy, 10 to 20 miles an hour. Best chance for rain and storms tonight, going to be after midnight northeast of Springfield, 70 the low temperature in Springfield, 74 in Harrison with a south wind. Seven-day forecast shows temps are going to back off as we head into the work week. Temperatures will be in the mid-80s, and there's that chance for rain. It continues all the way through early next week, Steve. Yes. It does include the 4th of July holiday weekend. Uh -huh. Now, not every single day is going to be a complete washout, but again, one of those weekends, which seems to happen around 4th of July, where we're watching the chance for isolated storms. So stay tuned to that forecast. It's a rain magnet.